So this is one of Gravel's new ice screws. This is the 720 Speedy. Uh, they've got some sweet features on them. So the first thing you're gonna notice is obviously this attached dog bone and carabiner. Essentially, it is your quick draw for the screw. Obviously, this is a nice rotating dog bone. It's not new to the ice screw industry, but this is Gravel's latest model of the version. This is pretty great because it saves you the weight and time of putting a quick draw on. It's no surprise you're gonna clip your ice screw once it's in the wall. So it's pretty nice to have these already attached. It also eliminates the need of an ice, uh, ice screw clipper or a carrot tool if, if you need that, especially avoiding those plastic ones. We like to prevent those from cracking and having our rack going down the wall. So using these metal carabiners is a nice way to attach. So these rack pretty, pretty comfortably on your harness, gates in or gates out. And then they, they hang really nicely together too. Um, so you can put on any gear loop. You can keep your ice clippers for, for your other screws, your longer screws, whatever you need them for. But um, it's really nice. You're already gonna be using the real estate for quick draws on your harness, so you might as well just put your screws there as well. They're gonna sit angled backwards really nice to keep the teeth away from your pant legs and, and snagging on other things. And you can obviously, if you rack gates out, you can just adjust the position of this carabiner within the dog bone to better facilitate which direction you want that ice screw to face. Uh, these little plume keeper carabiners are also gonna prevent uh, your, your quick draw essentially from cross-loading, which is another nice feature we like. Uh, and then if you need to extend it, you can obviously just clip straight into the gate like that. And then the second large change is this, this plunger uh, twist handle, which is pretty sweet as well. It makes for a nice flat surface when you are doing your half turns as you're, as you're starting the screw into the ice. Uh, and then when you go to pull it out and rotate it off to the side, it's a really long lever arm, so you get really good leverage. Uh, but you can also rotate from further out if you need to clear ice bulges or anything like that. These, uh, this stippling metal here does rotate as well, so it's really gonna twist well within your glove. It's just gonna spin into the ice really quickly. Gravel does have all their reverse cambered teeth on their screws. Uh, which helps a little bit in weaker ice um, to pre prevent the screw from pulling out. And then this is a four-toothed steel screw. It comes in two sizes, 13 centimeters and 16 centimeters. The 13 is gonna weigh in at 163 grams, and the 16 is gonna weigh in at 172 grams. As you screw into the ice, obviously a, a core of ice needs to eject out the back, um, which these steel screws are really good for. Uh, the steel doesn't have any anodization on it, so it's less likely to have the ice freeze on the inside because there's less texture for the ice to freeze to. Um, so steel screws are great for that aspect. This little plunger uh, is, as you pull it out, the ice is just gonna eject right out. And one of the nice features we like is as you've cleaned the ice screw as a follower, um, a lot of times you're gonna have an ice core stuck inside of the screw, uh, which you wanna clear relatively soon before it really freezes in there because as, as people who ice climb a lot know, you might get to the next pitch and find that that core is really stuck in there and you can't get it out. Um, the simple solution is to uh, use a V-threader tool to kind of plunge the ice out of the core of the screw. Um, but this can just facilitate a pretty rapid um, clearing. So you're probably gonna leave the plunger out once you've placed it on lead. There is probably gonna be an ice core in there um, that you won't be able to plunge it back in. But you'll just leave it out for your follower to clear. So I'm actually a huge fan of Gravel's ice screw caps personally. There's a lot of ice screw caps on the market. Um, some people go to Home Depot and buy feet for little uh, chairs to put on. They're uh, ice screws instead, but Gravel's caps are really beefy plastic and they have some little threads on there. So you actually screw it onto the screw, um, which prevents it from pulling off when it's in your backpack. Uh, a lot of ice climbers will be familiar with opening up their backpack and finding that their screw caps have fallen off, the teeth have gotten loose and kind of shredded a puffy or maybe something like that. So um, these are one of my favorite ice screw caps. They do fit on all ice screws. They fit on aluminum as well, which is an important distinction because aluminum ice screws tend to be a millimeter or two thicker. Um, so these will fit on steel or aluminum ice screws of all brands.